Hello, good morning. Today we are going to talk, uh, we are talking about uh, topic 7.1.3. That's the uh, third topic and subtopic in topic 7, control systems. In this topic, we are going to evaluate different input devices for the collection of data in specific situation. The objective is object three. So you need to find the more information about the different sensors and get the deep understanding about that. But the uh, scenarios will be based on the familiar situation to the student. Okay, first, what is a sensor? A normal sensor, a normal computer has no way of knowing what is happening in the real world around it. It's not like a human being, we have five sensors, right? So computer doesn't know it is light or dark, hot or cold, quiet or noisy. How do we know what is happening around us? We use our eyes, our ear, our mouth, our nose, and our screen, our senses. A normal computer has no senses, but we can give it some. We can connect sensors to it. A sensor is a device that converts a real world property, like uh, temperatures, into data that a computer can process. Just like uh, last class, we talked about the AD converter, the analog digital converter. That can convert the signal that we detect or we ca capture from the real world and to the binary number so the computer can understand it. There are some examples like a temperature sensor it's for detecting temperature a light sensor for detecting light or dark pressure sensor for detect the pressure like someone standing on it or for the uh, weight of a car let me give you more details example Microsoft Kinect sensor the Kinect sensor Bar contains the 3D deep sensors, a color camera, and a microphone array. They are used in conjunction with the Xbox 360 or Windows OS for motion sensing and voice control. Microsoft Kinect is supposed to shake up the video game console experience, announced and demonstrated as a project in June 2009. Kinect seems almost um, magical the way you, it can see every movement of your body and reproduce it within the video game you are playing. Plus, it recognizes your face and voice so it can pick you out in the room and know who you are. Even, even if you are playing with a group of friends. November two, uh, 2010, Max Kinect's um, history and uh, anticipated release as a new addition to Microsoft Xbox 360 product line. If you want more information about this product, you can check the link How Stuff Works, the Kinect sensor. Uh, Airfuel. Uh, ratio meter is a sensor uh, used in internal uh, com uh, combustion engines to determine how much oxygen is being opt uh, output by engine. So this uh, indicates whether all the oxygen is being used up and whether there is a malfunction in the engine. It can be used to optimize the uh, fuel efficiency of uh, an engine. Another example, UAV, the unmanned aerial vehicle. UAVs contains many kinds of sensors, such as uh, biological sensors, which can uh, detect the presence of uh, various uh, microorganisms in the air and other biological factors. 
as well as biological sensor UAVs contain uh, elect electromagnetic uh, uh, spectrum sensors which can detect uh, visible light and uh, infrared or, or near uh, infrared as well as uh, radar system. Here's a link about the different type of the sensors used in engineering applications. It uh, will take uh, 21 minutes, so let's watch it. <laughs> 